When shooting and editing iPhone footage in Premiere Pro, there is a chance you'll come across the issue of adding text that shows up as semi-transparent or gray. This is likely due to high dynamic range video, especially if your iPhone records in 10-bit HDR. Premiere Pro interprets HDR footage differently than standard dynamic range video, which causes washed out whites, gray text, and strange blending issues, even if opacity and blending modes are set correctly. There are three ways to fix this issue. Let's start backwards with having footage that has already been shot in HDR. In your Premiere Pro timeline, find the video you want to alter in the project panel and right click on the footage. Go to Modify and select Color. Go to Override Media Color Space and in the dropdown select Rec 709. Click OK. Now right click and select New Sequence from Clip and create your text. Two, let's say you have clips from another camera that shoots SDR video. You can right click that footage and select new sequence from clip. Then delete that file and drop in your iPhone clips. A pop-up will display reading clip mismatch warning. Select keep existing settings. The iPhone clip is interpreted and displayed with the SDR properties. And finally, if you want to take the preventative approach, go to your iPhone settings, scroll down and select camera, then record video and toggle off HDR video. Now when you right click and select new sequence from clip, you don't have to make any adjustments for your text to display properly.